All right, Zach, talk us through your game preparation. Um, basically the same preparation um, I have every game. It's pretty straightforward. Um, you know, get in, get in early, get treatment, get strapped, get all that kind of stuff out of the way early, and then just. Um, I won't say relax before the game, but uh, but kind of take it easy and just settle down because uh, you know nerves can get the better of some players. So I like to take it easy and just get my stretching done. Do you have any superstitions? Um, I wouldn't call it superstitions, but I do typically when I play games. Um, if if I strap my wrists, which I've been doing, um, didn't do it today, but I do write the same uh, player. It's the initials of a friend of mine who passed away. So I've been doing that for two years now. So I'll probably. I probably keep doing that um, for every game that I do strap, but um, no, I wouldn't say I have any big superstitions. So today was just a trial game, but is it important to try and stick to your same routine? <sighs> Look, it is for some players. I don't buy much into, um, you know, I wouldn't get too in my head about doing the same thing in the same order. So, yeah, look, for some guys, I know some guys like to listen to music and do everything, you know, in the, in the same order, but oh, look, I'll just get in and relax and try and get things done. So talk us through today's game, it was pretty hot out there. Yeah, it was pretty hot and obviously it doesn't go too well with me. I'm not, not going up with this kind of heat, but um, it was a shortened game today. It's always tough to get the first hit out. You can't train that kind of fitness. You just need to get out and do it. So um, I think we came through pretty uh, kind of everyone intact. So that was the main thing. So to get the first hit out done is a, is a big win. So Mick didn't coach one team specifically, but he obviously had a fair bit of influence over halftime. Yeah, he addressed the, both teams at halftime just on um, on the style of play and uh, how the ball was getting transitioned from the back line. He uh, probably wasn't quite what we were looking for. Um, I think it was better in the second half, but bear in mind, this is the first hit out and it's against your own team, so it's kind of hard to gauge you know, where we're at. But um, I think he'd be pretty happy with how things went. Got another trial game again next Friday. Is there anything that the coaches are specifically asking you to work on throughout the preseason? So he hasn't uh, mixed big on, on players being able to play, you know, several um, kind of roles for the team. So um, I mean, I've, I want to be able to move more onto the wing and, and add that string to my ball because uh, it does give you a, a better chance of being selected if you can kind of help the team out in more than one area. It's been a really long preseason. You guys started last October. Are you hanging for round one? Yeah, um, we sure are. Look, it's, it seems like a long time ago we were in Arizona and, and doing all that kind of tough training. And even since, uh, you know, since the Christmas breakup, it seems like a long time training. So we're all just uh, excited about playing games and uh, can't get around one quick enough.